Joining us right now, Savannah Williams. She is a sophomore at Harrington High School and her mother, Karen Gottlieb. Good morning to you, ladies. Hi, good morning. So, Savannah, the school gave you this laptop how long mm -hmm. ago? Uh, freshman year. Where do you keep it? In my bedroom, on my desk. Can you show us where the webcam is? Yeah. So you keep it in your bedroom. The little camera's right there. You keep it open? Yeah, all the time. So if this camera were activated, it would capture what types of things? Getting changed, doing my homework, taking a shower, everything. You take it to the bathroom too? Uh, yeah, to listen to music when I'm in the shower. So what was your first reaction when you heard that the school was accused of doing this? I was shocked. Someone um, told me in my chem class, I emailed my mom right away. It's like, Mom, I have this open all the time when I'm changing, when I'm in the shower. This is disturbing. And what, do, what are other students saying about it? Have you talked to your the friends? The same thing. Everyone was talking about it at school. The entire school knows about it. Everyone was really worried, like, what have they been watching me doing? Everyone's emailing their parents right away. And as a parent, Karen, what upsets you the most? This is a complete violation of our privacy, of, of our entire home, not just Savannah, but because this laptop is an integral part of her life and our life, it's open all the time in the home. They have um, the option to watch myself, my husband, my other child. They violated our trust. Um, I think that's really the most significant part here is that this was a school district that we chose. We moved a thousand miles across the country. Specifically, specifically for the school district. to be in this school district, which spoke volumes for my trust in them. And it's also quite possibly a violation of Pennsylvania law. Well, we should say that it may not be true because the school says that they only activate the, the camera when the computer is lost or stolen. Mm -hmm. Do you buy that as an explanation, Karen? That seems rather far-fetched to me. Um, if, in fact, that was their uh, intent, this would be an exceptionally uh, bad case of judgment on their part if that was their intent. I don't believe that for one instance, though. I'm not sure how a camera shot from a webcam would help locate a lost or stolen laptop. Well, now they say that they've deactivated, just in case anyone's concerned, they've deactivated this camera. Do you still feel safe using it at home? I don't. I've lost a lot of trust for my school district, and I'd like to be reassured that I can get changed in my own bedroom with my laptop open without having to be worried that someone's watching me. So you're not doing that anymore? No. What do you hope will come in the end? Um, just some reassurance from the school district. Not sure how they're going to do it, but mm. something that tells me I can do things in my own home without being worried that my principals are watching me. Certainly should be able to, right? Yeah. Savannah, thank you so much. Karen, thank you as well for coming in. Thank you.